She got everything, cause she bang with us Hook her on the team, bang She a little button for the cameras We got everything that you need Nigga, you stupid, bro I don't know what type of boots you think for that I'm telling you, like, the only way for this to happen Somebody's gonna, his privilege gotta kick in like, me, it's, there's either some super ass strong person on Wano. This nigga Mihawk is gonna be cruising by Wano, cause you know he out there in that area. He be chilling, man. I, I, thought, Mihawk was out there. I thought Mihawk was like from Wano or some shit like that. I thought there was some Ooh, relation with Mihawk no, and Wano. That's a theory. Even then, Kata was a smack shadow, uh, um, Mihawk. You tweaking. I mean, it's not gonna be what? a whole oh, Wait, 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 wait. I mean, the strongest I think, sword you don't think can go toe to toe with it. No! I think Kata would be the but it's not going to be easy to beat. I mean, he's going to work it in like How much stronger do you think Mihawk is than Jimbe? Huh, what? what? How much stronger uh, do you think Mihawk is than Jimbe? Not, that's the question I asked. If Why you think they're close, just because. then yeah. Because Jimbe was still able to say, hey, Big Mom, I'm going to try and like relax. Like, he was still ready to to go with Big Mom. Would he have beat her? Hell no. But he definitely had more of a chance than Luffy and them. What I'm saying yeah. is, well, so I'm gonna say it's kind of better. Jim Bay to me is the second hitter. strongest Shibukai, probably. I don't know who would have been. Mihawk is arguably the strongest, right? No, I, th- I think. Who else is strong? I think, think Doflamingo is the second strongest. Okay, so that's fine. Second yeah, strongest. Well, so Mihawk gotta be stronger than Doflamingo. Doflamingo was a little bit shook by te- what's his face. A little bit. I mean, he, he was, was terrified shook. of Kaido. He was Kaido. shook by Kaido. Yes. But Mihawk definitely had a rivalry with the Yonko, bro. If you don't think that Mihawk, the strongest swordsman in the world, has a chance against the Yonko, you wild fan. I don't, I think, don't think so. You have too much respect. I'm not going to say he's winning. I mean, I'm not saying he's winning. I'm saying has a chance, bro. Said, Luffy one on has one? zero chance. They said zero chance, yeah, exactly. right? They say one on one always bet on Kaido. That's, that's that's literally what they said in the in the series. That's totally one on one bet on Kaido. But I'm saying the strongest swordsman in the world. I don't get what you're saying. I still think yeah, I don't get what you're saying. Like I said, I'm saying, I'm gonna say like Kaido's gonna get like one hit by by Kaido. I don't think so. But he's still. But he, I don't think he had a chance of beating Kaido. At all. he's still a Chichibu Kai. I was saying if if like, him and Kaido fight a hundred times, Kaido will a hundred times. Hold on, so I don't think, it's think about it like times. this. Yeah, Ten. that's fine. But but him it's, being there allows an opening for a group of niggas to beat him. Do we think Mihawk is stronger than the admirals? Yeah, I think which admirals we talking about? We talking about new admirals or all old the ones? Admirals. Bro, every Any else. admiral we was actually we've actually seen. What are you talking about? Do we think Mihawk is stronger than them? I think he could take on Fujitora for sure. You think Fuji Tour, Green Bull, hell yeah. Do you think he can beat, um, what's the lava buddy? If you're talking about the old <laughs> animals, <laughs> that's a different, can now we have a different argument. Can he beat a Kano? I think they close, but I think a Kano will edge it out. Can, can a Kano beat Kaido? Fuck no. Uh, he took out White Beard. I didn't, I didn't want Kaido be White Beard. If we use a One Piece lore, a Kano took on White Beard, bro. It was his strategy but we that took that guy out. And we saw that this nigga That's why was all, sick. All I'm using is who was the logic all the niggas, niggas love to use. Fight. All I'm using is logic. Why would I beat him though? Fighting. What do you mean? No, he didn't beat him. Yes. He beat him that first time and then got back up and embodied him. Like, he wasn't dead. I mean, Luke, nobody dies in one piece. So what like, if it was a fight, it was a quick fight, White Beard won. But even then, kind of... If it would have been 1v1... Once again, White Beard, I think White, White Beard, Beard in his prime, beat. stronger or weaker than Kaido? We don't know. I don't know. He's stronger than Kaido. We don't know that. In his prime? This nigga said, they said, one on one, this nigga will yeah, not lose. No, but that was at, <laughs> like, this that is, was at this the current time. Now. I know, but I'm saying, we don't know. There was, like, their times, their times didn't overlap. We don't know. This, this, nigga, Ky, this nigga, Whitebeard, was labeled as the strongest man in the world, fam. And Kyle was the strongest thing. Creature. Creature. Nah, like, nah, nah, nah. When Whitebeard got sick. We've only heard the strongest creature shit after the point that Whitebeard was obviously weaker than most of the Yonko. But I'm not. But I think Kaido would be big man. That's what he's saying. Yeah, he did what? So, so when they say strong man, man, they're not counting Kaido in that shit because, because he's, he's not a human, thing. right? That's, okay, so, yeah. so if we have a bunch of creatures and this is the pinnacle of the creatures, and we have a bunch of swordsmen and this is the pinnacle of the swordsmen, I mean, even, and we have a bunch that, of men and this is the pinnacle of a man, there's no way to correlate who's actually stronger than who if you want to use it. So oh, no, the strongest swordsman, I don't think you can touch the strongest person. Like you're a swordsman, you're like one part of one type of fighter. So if I'm if I'm the physically strongest person in the world, you're telling me that someone with a blade cannot kill me? 
White bears are the physically strongest person, person, person in the world. He's the strongest man in the world. When they say strongest, they don't mean lifting strongest. They mean like fighting strongest. They said it's strongest. Because, it's because he has he a very strong ability. The world. That's but, I, but no, but I'm just saying from his argument of like, oh, okay, the strongest swordsman can't beat the strongest man. I don't think that that's true. Like what what you're using to say that they, they can't win. Because he's also a man. What do you mean? I mean, he's also, <laughs> he's also a human. The fact that he's a human, you say, oh, oh. Bro, okay, let me put it this way. The fact that he's the strongest man does not mean he can curb stomp the strongest sword. Bro, I never said. I never said. I'm not saying you said that. Said. I'm just saying that's what it sounds like you are. I for. specifically said that I don't think Kyle would run up on Mihawk and be like, man, it's a wrap. No, I don't think that's that what happens. I'm saying. So all I'm saying is if Mihawk is in the area, he will at least give him some go. That's what he'll give him enough go to yeah, buy he, the fight. He'll buy them a couple win. minutes, like two, three minutes. I'm just saying he'll buy. He can buy them enough time <laughs> to actually beat them. You don't think if Mihawk is there that they would still not be able to beat Kaido, the whole group of them? Uh, oh yeah, I think they could. No, I don't think so. Wow, because I yeah, think I it, it would be the whole game. to tell you. I, I think in the end it would still just be Mihawk versus Jack. Kyle. Got cut up by a random ass samurai. I think Jack. I'm just saying, bro. Like he's gonna be the dog of the. Yeah, it's, it's literally like Jack can, Okay, so if that's the case, you know what I mean? How do you think they're going to be Kaido if, if they wouldn't We be already have more. enough power there to like mostly take out his his backup. And if we lucky, oh, and okay, okay, Jack is actually his right hand man strongest, bro, it's like with the dog cat and shoot to Mario, shoot to Mario, like bye bye, Jack. Oh, yeah, like, nigga, you ain't there. Let me go. We're still going to the six samurais, right? Or maybe no, four? No, they're missing three. I think they're missing three. I gotta check. So look at like that. So is out. when you say when you say all these people, who are you talking about? Use this kid, Law. Oh, he's talking about all of them. Exactly. Me, Law, for the whole thing. Oh, game, game, yeah. game shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you meant like yeah, yeah, yeah. Law, Luffy, and Me, Law. No, much. I'm talking about the game, nigga. You know the game is gonna come through. Yeah. Killer, Zoro, all them niggas versus. Oh no, it's over. It's over. Yeah, I mean, yeah, they got they beat anyone like that, yeah. No, they wouldn't be kind of without a big powerhouse. No, yeah. I'm talking about if they had Mio. I yeah, think, that's what I'm saying. I think Mio think Mio Mio is enough of a powerhouse that he could show up because I think it's too early. If Shanks shows up, it's a world ending event. Like, if Shanks shows up to blow I mean, I don't think Mio's going to show up. Big Mom's going to show up. Yeah, she is. Uh, if that's the case, then fuck it. I mean, them fat ass motherfuckers can fight, man. That's cool. <laughs> fat ass who? Kyle fat, nigga. That nigga big. That nigga, he ain't fat, though. That nigga ain't fat, bro. When I say fat, I mean, like, he big, bro. <laughs> if that's the case, then that's fine, But they ain't gonna fight each other, though. No, yeah. I, no, I think they will, for sure. I, I don't see... Because they, I don't see fighting to the death. Because Big Mom's death to the fuck up movie. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna fight to the death. I think they're gonna fight so the weekend... The weekend Kaido. So you're saying they're gonna be fighting over this fucking... Know, this beat-up Luffy over here. I think... <laughs> no, it's because he said, Big Mom, if you come to my territory, I'm gonna kill you. Bitch, like, so I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> I, no, he said simply if she comes there. Yeah, that's what she. I don't know. Or, 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 or if she interrupts him trying to fuck up. Uber. No, I think she Probably said. Both. I think he, she said. He said if they, she stepped foot on in Wano, here you will die. Here's what I'll say: okay. is I, I really hope that Big Mom and Kaido aren't that stupid. That's all I'm saying. Because I think that would be the stupidest thing for both of them to be Yonko. And I think Big Mom has displayed the fact that she, she does doesn't. actually think strategically. Oh. She does actually think strategically. I can't go to the exact moments, That's but sad. if you go through like the beginning yeah. of the thing, she she talked about some of her plans and strats and why she didn't make certain moves that she did in the world. So all I'm saying is she does things strategically. So it'd be very yeah. stupid for two young girls to fight over one little insignificant oh, no, I, person. I, I, it and then Luffy it. just standing there and goes, I'm just going to beat the one that's about to die. Like, like, uh, no, I would see them turn around and go, how about we just both kill this nigga and then move on and call it a truce, right? Uh, but I could, feel like that's wild. It's, it's no, stupid, I, but personally, I, I'm telling you, like, stupidest thing for I Luffy to get out of this... Of the island, some bullshit has to happen. Right, which I'm like, <laughs> it's gonna happen. Me on this it's reasonable way. bullshit. Shanks would be out of control bullshit because if Shanks showed up, it would be like a world ending event. Like people would be like, all right, so two youngers are now deciding that they want to fucking fight. Like but that I, would change. Thing, I don't that think it has the whole shit. I don't think it has any. Like me all guys no like connection to this at all. For him to show up, like it, but that would be super random. And me all just out of nowhere. Especially with yeah. this. I, I think Mihawk can show up because I think we're going to get a test of Zoro's ability here. And I think we need another, an alt group. So with Don Flamingo, the alt group was, we had the Marines there, and then we had the Revolutionary Army there. The, oh, and actually, there we, we did get some respect on them. In oh, the Marines are coming too, So by the way. Remember? 
So there we go. So maybe it's a marine power, which to me would make sense why Mihawk was there because Mihawk's a Shibukai. So they were probably what? like, "Hey, Mihawk, we need you to run this mission." Why, 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 why did they set on Mihawk though? Because we're in Wano. What does Mihawk have to do with Wano? This is Zoro's. This is the year of Zoro. Whether they say it or not, this is Zoro's chance at respect. So he got to level up in some sort of shit way. So me, say, best say, way would be he gets dropped. Mihawk's there. He shows, hey, bro, I know you put in work. You still got like two more levels to go, my G. And then he leaves. That's uh, it. I just don't see, I just don't see Mihawk. I, I, hey, I just see, like, if that's fine. Like Jack or something like that. That's, that these are all serious, fam. I don't see any person mentors coming up to help them at yeah. any point. You don't in think the near so? Future. I would see. Like, I don't see. Like, I don't see, like, 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 see Rayleigh. Yeah. I don't see Rayleigh coming back to help Luffy at any time. So right, I don't because see I think Luffy's mentorship now. If anybody's showing up to help Luffy, legit, it's only two people: Shanks or Dragon. Those are the only two people left True. that we need anything That's from. Fine. All of the other people that have touched Luffy's life, that are quote unquote mentors, they did their part. Riley did his part. He's like, "All right, bro, I'm out. Peace." Yeah, you live the rest you, of your life. You think Mihawk didn't finish? His I didn't job. When Shanks shows up, when Shanks shows up, it's impactful, meaning that Luffy is. Finally reached that that level. Cause Shanks is like, look, bro, I let you out of this thing, but next time I ever let you out, like it's not gonna be that. Next time we see each other, it better be on like some on you at my level shit, on right? Site. You, you don't think, you don't, think the, you don't feel the same thing with me, though? I know. Exactly. I think the same That's thing though. No, yeah. I don't think I don't. We didn't get enough of how Mihawk and Zoro trained to see that it was gonna be on site next time. I think we got enough that Zoro knows that this is what it means to compete at this level. That's all Zoro got. Zoro got. This is the skills you need to even be in the contender for like um, greatest swordsman. Say we, we haven't got. And anything you now with need Shanks. to work on those skills. Same thing. We haven't gotten anything with Shanks. Is what I'm saying. What do you mean? What does Shanks have to teach Luffy? That's what I'm saying. Like, so you're saying like we haven't gotten enough of Mihawk, but I'm saying we haven't gotten anything of Shanks at all. No, because Shanks is end goal. Yeah. Shanks and is at the end. Mihawk is Zoro's end goal. No, yeah, it's Mihawk yeah. is Zoro's fighting end goal. Like, but at the end of the day, there's no, that, 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 that nigga's goal. But that is his end goal. That, that is fighting. That is his end goal. That is Zoro's actual goal to be um, the strongest swordsman right. in the world. So I, I don't think I don't think Mihawk's gonna show up at least for a while. Like, I don't think I don't see him just showing up in Wano. I just see this. Is I think Mihawk has his own. If anything, he deserves his own arc. Kind or a, mm. a mini arc at least. I feel like this is a respect to put on Zoro's name, and to me, only the only other mentor we have, unless they're gonna pull out his fucking master or find out that his but, his the chick that we thought was dead is still alive. So like, why why do you need his mentor to be able to put respect on his name? Why can't he just like cut the fuck about a jack and then? Oh. That's what I'm saying. There might be some there might be some other power there that's like not Mihawk equivalent, but like good enough. That like he's up there swordsman level to give Zoro the respect he needs to go to the next if, level. Okay, so but I just felt like Mihawk is a person I saw doing that. That's so all. if the, it could be the, the vice, what's, what's it called? The three people? What are they called? The Admirals? No, um, oh, Kyle 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 yeah, the Calamities. Calamities. Yeah, those. One of those are a swordsman. Yeah, that's right. Then yeah, I don't need Mihawk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's all I'm saying. What about this legend that the editors were supposedly or Oda was supposedly teasing? What legend? There's some legend that's going to appear in Wano also. I that's thought probably was... also going to be some legend. Hashtag Mihawk. Like, <laughs> <laughs> this nigga just want to see Mihawk. Hashtag like. Mihawk in this bitch. Yeah, that's he, he only legend fan, I know. Huh? What other legend I know? I'm not a Zoro fan. I just what know are, that this is his art. What do they call them? SBAs or some shit like that? Who? It's, it's um, not Rob Lucci, bitch ass. I know ain't this CP0. He's not a legend. One of the interviews with Oda, he was saying that there's going to be some legend that appears. Who's gonna, uh, you know? Okay, so let's gonna go through the list of legends that we know today: <laughs> Gark, Mihawk, <laughs> or Say Goku, the guy they were talking about. Who? We know Shiki, the guy they were Shiki talking about. Is a legend. Uh-huh. Is he still alive though? Yeah, he is. Oh, but, so um, yeah, there are people who think that he was the one that was sitting with a uh, buddy that what's the name of buddy that's uh, chilling with Laboon, the big ass will. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I um, the yeah. doctor, the yeah, doctor that, of Cole yeah, Rogers. Yeah, that was yeah. one of those panels where what? he was sitting and having What's the uh, name tea of with the, somebody um, from the back, and it looked like she remember, like when they were talking, the, the Marines and Goblin, they was talking about some old like pirate at Kaido and Big Mom. I think oh, rocks. Yeah, him, his ass. The, the captain of locks or rocks. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I'm going for Mihawk. That's my legend. <laughs> let's go. Let's see it. All I'm saying, if I'm right. <laughs> Ooh, I'm right, uh, but um. Uh, we'll like we're gonna see that. <laughs> <laughs> I know y'all will. I'm gonna start saving these clips real quick. <laughs>